<laughs> oh crap, I'm recording! <laughs> hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Mimana Yar Chronicle. Sorry, I've been listening to the Rockman Holic album for a while, so Xbox is stuck in my head. Anyways, last time we left off, we had entered our seventh dungeon. Our second to last one, if you would. And we're pretty much just going to be going through it. We are going to need the level stuff. Who do I have equipped right now? Sophie, Mel, and Fade, because they need the levels. Okay, yeah, we're good. Let's explore, shall we? This dungeon is going to be all trial and error for me, because I don't remember it at all. As you can see, there's a bunch of holes in the floor. Oh, I found a staircase. And I'm getting static from my headphones again. Oh, a spirit drop. What does that do again? Shows to go how long I've been playing. HP. Oh, I still have these. Uh, let's see who needs it the most. Come on, headphones, stop giving me static. There we go. Uh, da -da 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 -da, the person who needs it the most is Mel. Give Mel the HP and the MP. I'll give to. I'm gonna give it to Patty because I'm gonna be using her near the end of the game. Okay, so that staircase is broken, meaning we can't go up, so we have to go down. Oh, there's more. St oh, there's only holes. Let's go down. Oh, chest. <laughs> ah, so now that the oh, princess Tiara, you're kidding me, right? Oh, oh. <laughs> Ouch. Oh well, bunny ears give me more stats, so... Selling water! Anyways, as I was saying before I cut myself off... I've completely forgotten! <laughs> I remember what I was gonna say. Now that the Christmas rush is over and we're in liquidation with work, yes, um... Zellers will be no more after March 16th, which makes me sad because it's been around since I was a little kid. Veil break. What's with all giving me all this stuff now? Oh, Veil Bray's more. Yay! Okay, equip. I'm just surprised I haven't run into any enemies yet. But yeah. Zellers has been. Wasn't expecting that. Zellers has been around since I was. Oh, crap, I'm dead. <laughs> Ready, guys? Now let's go. I'm so dead. Oh no, you don't. Living sword, go away. Don't attack Sophie, I won't let you. Oh, this is blasting in my ears, meaning it's too loud. Oh. Turn it down. It seems I am victorious. Fade is freaking awesome. I'm probably going to be using her as much as I can. I forgot my train of thought again. I've really forgotten it this time. Jeez. Ah, it goes to show how well of a memory I have. I don't even remember where to go in this. Okay, I just went around in a circle. There's a hole there. Mm, trying to remember what I was saying. Oh well. More enemies. Let's go! Pretty amazing, a Kraken? You know? And a snow crab. Don't give them the chance to cast! Blue circle means we'll heal! It seems I am victorious. At least we're getting a bunch of levels now. And from here on, this is probably where I'm gonna start max leveling. There is a level cap on your first playthrough of the game. Hmm. Well, let's try going... If I wasn't rudely interrupted by enemies... Get ready! I'll do my best! I'm just concentrating... Ah, a little... Oh, well. Fade is freaking awesome. I love her. Now let's try going down this hole. Woo! I think the 
objective of this level or dungeon is to find the right path through all the gaps. If I didn't run into walls! More swords and more crabs. Let's go! I'll do my best! Living sword. One's fire, one's blue. Leave Sophie alone! Take that. Are too ephemeral. Maha. And another level up. Woohoo! Okay. There, I'm not stuck on the wall anymore. If I do get entirely lost, I'll just cut to a new area or speed up to a new area. Whatever works. Don't fall in that hole. Let's fall in this one. Uh, this should be a new area. A the hole there. Staircase leading up. Let's go through this door. Oh, enemies everywhere. I need the XP though. Oh, that's a lot of cracking. Watch out, guys! I'm pretty amazed. It's a small one. <laughs> this is a small one. I do not want to see a large one. Alright! Farewell. I love Fade's attacks! She's both short and long range, it's freaking awesome! And oh, there is a staircase leading down. Let's see where it goes. I gotta remember to put up a spell. Leveled up, woo! And before I forget, Angel's Blessing. Haha. <laughs> oh, another chest. And a Stone of Flame 5. Oh. What? Huh? Why do I have two? Oh, this is Stone of Flame, not Stone of Fire. Derp! And there's a reason I fell down that crack. Apparently it took us to this. Ah, I wasn't expecting an enemy. Okay, there were some heavy krakens in that one, and I think I'm stuck. Oh, here we go. Empty. It's empty? Huh? It's empty. Really? That's strange. This treasure chest. Master, is something wrong? There's a string in the back. What is this? Hmm? Master. <gasps> what the? Huh? What? Master, are you hurt? Don't come closer. What's wrong? Sophie? <gasps> Hold on. The smell. It's from a poisonous plant called the cockatrice's eye. Poisonous plant? This is probably a trap made from the cockatrice's eye. It's very unstable, so it should just dissolve into the air before too long, and we'll be fine. Just wait a little longer. Sophie, are you all right? I... I'm fine, but... Fade is... Fade! Don't come near. Poison, huh? All right, Patty. Use your magic. I can't. Magic and medicines won't work on this poison. Then what are we gonna do? Well, uh... I think I've heard of this. 
The poison doesn't act immediately. It's rather special, you see. It keeps you conscious while your body goes numb. Eventually, it kills you. It's used mainly for torture and interrogation. Uh, uh, although, perhaps we didn't need to know that. Mel! That's not helpful! What are we going to do? Well, if you boil some Lipsaris... Patty! Where can we find some Lipsaris? What is it? Oh, it's a plant. It isn't very rare. There are probably some in the field up top, but it's hard to find. What do you mean? Well, they don't grow in groups, so it can be hard to find. But we can still find it in the field up top, right? I think so. All right, let's go find it then. Do you really have the time to be doing something so stupid, Grace? Stupid? Fade? Huh? Please, don't say that. Saving you isn't stupid. Please. Very well, Master. Can we take Fade with us? We probably shouldn't move her. It would only make the poison spread faster. Let's split up. I don't think it's a good idea to leave Fade here all alone. You're right. I'll go to the field, but I'll need some help. Then I suppose I should go as well. I've only seen it in books, but at least I know what it looks like. I'm sure I can be of help. Then, I'll go with you too, Pat. I'd worry about the two of you. Are you... Sophie, you should go too. What? But what about Fade? Patty, you need as many people as possible, right? Yeah, it has a very distinctive shape. If I tell you what it looks like, anyone should be able to find it. Then I'll be fine here. I'm not real good at scavenger hunts. Fighting's more my style. Wait, you mean... you think Fade might... No, this thing... I mean Fade. She protected Sophie, so now it's my turn to protect her. Grace... Sweetheart! So how long's it gonna take for this poison to... you know... do its thing? Well, normally, about a day. However, as I'm sure you are aware, Fade is a homunculus. I can't say if it will affect her the same way. It's possible it will take much longer to run its course, but there's no way to know. It could even be faster. And you guys better get moving. Okay, let's go. Yes, yes. This situation demands dedication, even from me. I promise we'll find it. Hang in there, feed. Please, please take good care of her. How are you holding up, Fade? It's getting harder and harder to move. Damn it, guys. Where the hell are you? Don't... don't worry about it. What the hell kind of thing is that to say? How can I not? Why are you so worked up? I'm nothing more than a puppet. Besides, to you, I'm nothing more than... Look, at least for now, you're not my enemy. I still... don't understand. Idiot. You've wasted too much time. What? We're surrounded. Damn it! Monsters! Forget about me. Just get out of here. Shut up! Just shut up! I made a promise. I swore to protect Sophie. And you saved her. So that means I'm gonna protect you too. <laughs> I pity you. Here they come! This is new. I've never seen this before. My memory on this is very different from this. Ready, guys? Yeah. So for now, I think my job is just to defend. If I can get them caught in the pattern, that's perfect. Yeah, I'm taking a lot of damage, though. Oh boy. There's... too many of them. I'll take them all down! I thought it was your duty to protect... my master. If you die here, who will take your place? 
What are you trying to say? Why are you going so far to protect me? Let me ask you something. Why are you protecting Sophie? Because to do so is the single sworn duty of a homunculus. Duty? Huh. What's wrong? Get ready to fight! Oh, this is interesting. And I hope I don't die. <laughs> Let's go. I have to concentrate so quiet. Damn it, you have to be an attack, don't you? Oh, this is unfair! Yeah! Yeah! Steal it! Ha! Alright! Oh boy. Don't tell me this is an endurance battle. I'm not gonna be happy. Is this is this it? Are you alright, Fate? Fate! What? It's over already? So it would seem. <laughs> Why? Is it not your duty to protect my master? Yeah. Then why are you not doing so? Leave me. You should be... at her side. I can't do that. You... contradict yourself. Like hell. I'm gonna protect you and Sophie. <sighs> You're too soft. Someday, that will cost my master her life. That's not true. See, even just now, I kept her safe. Are you all right, sweetheart? Uh, this goes here and there. Patty, you're amazing! You finished it while we were on our way here. Well, I had all of you looking out for me. Otherwise, I don't think I could have. Sweetheart, you're hurt! That's eh, nothing. Just got attacked by a few monsters. Worry about me later. Fade needs that antidote. Yes! Fade, please drink this. It should heal you right away. Hmm. Fade? Sorry to worry you, Master. Looks like Patty's medicine did what it was supposed to. That's one less thing to worry about. Alright, we can keep going, or we can turn around and rest for the night. What's it gonna be? Well, I'm ready to keep going, but I'll leave that up to you, Grace. But all of you, thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks to you, Fade is going to be fine. Hmm. How do you feel, Fade? I am fine. Well, I don't much care what we do. So long as we do something. Yes, let's do our best, everybody. All right, it's high time we booked it out of here. Hmm. I'm sorry. This is all because of me. You needn't apologize. This is my duty. Even so, thank you. There is no need to thank me either. No, no, I... I want to thank you. Hmm. But, Fade... What is it, Master? Please don't ever do this again, okay? I cannot promise that. Please. Is that... an order? Please, I'm asking you not to, Fade. Hmm. I have been told that you once put your life on the line to protect Grace. Is that not true? Yes, I did, but you can't do that. Hmm. Anyway, that's how it's going to be, all right? Let's go. Understood.
fade. Yes. Now this is being contradictory. Hmm. That's actually quite interesting. Anyway, I need to heal. Why am I using Sophie's magic? I never heal with Grace. Jeez. Anyways, I am going to save because that's actually quite interesting. I've never gotten that before. It must depend on the characters because this room was completely different when I played the first time. Forest of Souls, 458. Oh, I'm reading the wrong one. 1042, 1117. Okay, Forest of Souls override. Save complete. Let the game load. And we want to get to that boss panel there. Well, oh, that was quick. Why is it here? Interesting. I think a fly just flew in my room. Hmm. Is this the wrong path or something? Must be. They only let me teleport to three spots. Oh well. Return gate? Yes. That was interesting. So we're back at the beginning. Well, since I went down last time... Quite interesting. Hmm. Now I'm a little confused. Still, that cutscene was actually quite interesting. What's down this way? Another chest. And a place to fall down. Well, let's go down. Let's see what. Aww. <laughs> Boo. It appears Chris has learned a new magic. Mon. Mon oh, Mana Heal. Woohoo. Please tell me that was it. Oh, that was it. Mana Heal. Woohoo! I can f fully heal a person. Now. The game went and s changed my party on me. There. Okay. So let's see. 42, 41, 35, 39. <sighs> Sophie's gonna need a lot of work. I'll do some grinding before the final dungeon, that's all. And the staircase again. There's that hole we took. Okay, that was more trouble than it was worth. And let's just head all the way back up since I know I'm going the wrong way. So... At least we know where our return point's always going to be, the broken staircase here. And during that fight, Mel learned new magic. Let's see what it is. Uh, she already knew Grand Magus. Hmm. Oh, she knows that already. Oh no, I guess not. This must be the new one. So restrainer must be a stronger version of gravity because it immobilizes the enemy. Woohoo! Oh, doors this way. Oh, before I forget, they always also changed my attack positions. There. I'd prefer them being back there anyways. Uh, do, 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 dodge these. Head back to our starting point. I don't want to fall in another hole, so I didn't want to leave! Back in. Okay, heal up. Go this way. There's got to be a staircase leading up if there was that broken one there. Maybe, I think. I don't recall. Mm -hmm. 
Still getting a decent amount of experience. That's a plus. Now, if I'm remembering right, there was a staircase here. Chest at the end. So let's take the staircase. And see where it takes us. Sweet, Sophie's about to level up. Okay, there's a hole there. Before I go in there... I'm curious. I might not repel very many monsters, but at least I repel them. There is down here. Okay, so now I know where that is. Meaning... That hole that's kind of in the middle of everything. I wonder where it leads. It was down this way, wasn't it? Because it's just one lone little hole. Back here. Okay, good to know. So I need to find the right one. It has been a long time since I've played in this dungeon. If I do end up in the same room again, I'll just head to the... I'll use, um, Tinon's Return Magic. Eject, that's the name. Well, let's try you. Another fall? Back here. Okay, Sophie learned a new magic spell. What'd she learn? Ah, do, 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 do. What looks different? Looks like... Angel's Purity 2? No. I think it was Angel's Symphony. That looks new to me. No. It was Angel's Purity 2, because Angel's Blessing used to be here. Okay, good to know. Anyways... Before I forget. There. All healed up. I regenerate magic like crazy because I tend to conserve it. Go up. In the door. No enemy. Well, I took quite the hit there. Okay, so we did that one. Let's try this one. My foot's numb. Where'd this take us? Over here. Well, that was pointless. <sighs> well, just eject. And I'm gonna stop here. I don't really recall this dungeon at all, so I'm gonna look it up and see what it where I need to go, that way we aren't constantly going around in circles. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Me Mana Year Chronicle. This is Autumn Child saying, I'll see you all next time. Bye!